guys, so welcome to another video. Today I'm on my tramp. Um, I'm gonna also give a little cold tutorial, and I'm also gonna do some other tricks because just with the tutorial, it will, it will like get um, just too short. And I'll do another some other tricks too. And um, yeah, let's see. So guys, um, I'm gonna start with the Cody tutorial. Um, first of all, the steps you um, need to be able to are a backflip, a stomach jump, and a back jump. It's literally what you should be able for to do a Cody. And um, yeah, let's try to get into the video. So um, the first step is literally just a stomach jump. like keep your hands like that because like that you can push off if you want to like do more more high stuff on cody's like and um just keep them like that because chesty Hevels have always done it like with these um with like the stretched arms but it doesn't really works like that pretty good because um he always says hard for him to double and with that you can like easily quad cody and stuff um, it's a lot easier like that and just do a stomach drop from that to back do that a couple times as you feel comfortable with it and um, try to feel the rotation and feel if you could do it around or not so yeah so if you feel comfortable with that stomach landing to back um, and if you feel rotation, um, important is if you hock it, like, if you want to hock it directly and you're not too scared of it, um, just important to always keep your talk, like, wide so, um, you don't hit your nose with your knee, like, or don't hit your face with the knee. can really hurt, um, but... Yeah, pretty sure, pretty important is that. And, um, yeah, so the next step is literally if you, like, don't, if you don't really feel comfortable with, um, hock it directly through, um, you can, like, also turn over your shoulder. That's what I'm showing you a bit, a bit. But, um, you can also like take something soft on the tramp because then it's a lot easier um, So uh, you can learn it like that so because it doesn't really hurt if you like have your tuck wide You also can hit your knee really um, But I'll show you in a bit um, You how you do it like the best when you don't feel comfortable for right hucking it over your head. So yeah So, um, as you could have seen, it's like pretty safe like that. And I didn't even put a mattress on it. And if you do it without a mattress, the only thing is what can happen is like to um, get a tram burn or something. And you could have also seen that I turned over my left shoulder. If you're like turning over the other side, it's like literally the same thing. But I took like my right leg like a bit straight that I can like turn over. Um, that's how I can he hit my like head. And if you turn over right shoulder, it's literally the same thing with the left knee. Um, yeah, so let's go to the next step. So if you really feel comfortable with like turning over your head, um, shoulder and you wanna try it over your head, next step is going over your head and try to land on hands and knees. It's literally a really safe landing like that. But I also haven't said about it yet. Um, you can literally also do the same thing with the backflip before. If you if you're able to backflip to stomach, um, you can do it like backflip to stomach. Then Cody, I always felt I'm having more rotation with that in the first couple of times, and I can also easily do it that backflip. But I literally learned it with the backflip before, it, and I really found like I got more rotation like the first one first ones I literally did without backflip I think but then I like thought I didn't get that with much rotation as I would get with a backflip before it um 
But um, yeah, so um, we're going to do a backflip before, before it. Um, you should just do it like that, how you feel safer. And um, yeah, and the last step is literally to land the Cody on your feet. If you like, don't really think you're getting to feet, something important is to sit to land safe is to um don't like try to land in your knees or something and then like stretch something or like break something um just if you don't like get around just try to like put your hands down and like just put your hands down um that's really safe like that So this was literally it with this small tutorial. Um, I hope it literally helped you a bit um, and help you get the trick. And um, also, um, like, um, if you practice it much, you can also do it to stomach again. And then you can, like, jump higher and, like, keep more on it. Um, and, like, do much more Cody's on it. So, um... That's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, but now uh, I'm just gonna normal sesh a bit. Um, nothing too too hype happening, I'm pretty sure. Um, but yeah, I'll see. like that trick it's harder than you guys think is like i was literally from the acon sign back to the corner and i should have still keep the height and don't like travel too much to still can do the kaboom like drop kaboom pretty good um yeah and i'll do um some pullover stuff my goal is to do one bounce, pull over, and then pull over, full out. Stomach would be pretty nice. <laughs> 